Helping couples all over mid-Missouri. Still want to hook up? Or at least trying to. Goodbye. Hook up or hang up. It is Cosmo and the Y107 Morning Show. Cosmo here. Allison is here now, too. If I push the button right. Allison, are you there? I am. Yay, Good morning. Good. I don't know why I had a little panic moment. I just looked at the phone and went, I've done this a bazillion times. No, a sudden I thought I screwed I'm it up. Here. Good. She is here on the Level Up Hotline. Uh, so first of all, thank you for listening. Thanks for reaching out. So what is the deal? What do you think is going on here with Will? What's 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 up? Uh, well, you know, things are not going real great. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> I'll say he's been avoiding me at the very least. Okay. I'm not really sure what I did to get him this upset. So... So then, I guess my question is, do you? How do you know how upset is he? Did he tell you something in a text or in a message or what? Uh, yeah, he asked me not to contact oh. him again. Oh, <laughs> right. So I kind of know something's bothering him. Okay, so wait, he told you don't contact me again, and now you're trying to get me and to contact I him. <laughs> <laughs> I I feel like there was a misunderstanding. <laughs> wow. Okay. Um, so then what, what is your, th- what happened? Tell me what you know or what you think you know. Well, okay. I, I honestly don't feel like anything major or bad happened. I will say, I think I may have gone a little overboard with messaging him. Um, I really liked him and I was excited to see him again and I sort of lost it. Can I ask what overboard means to you or what, what what's when we say overboard uh, <laughs> defense exhibit A um, is what are we looking at here? <laughs> like a bunch of messages? Well, two weeks. Yeah, it's been two weeks since our date and I've definitely sent him a couple of messages each day. Oh jeez. So nice. yeah. So we're pushing it's, like 25, yeah, 30 messages. Oh, that is a lot. Let's keep it under 30. Let's say like maybe okay. 28. What's the we'll, difference? <laughs> we'll round it down. So like. I like I like Here's the deal. I wasn't planning on sending that many messages. Have you ever had something that like just happens? Like I messaged him the day after the date and he didn't respond. So I started thinking, oh my God, maybe he didn't get the messages and I resent them. And then when he didn't respond, I started following up and it just sort of spiraled from there. Right. Okay, so real quick, before we uh, try and get him on the phone, let's go back to the beginning. Do you, how, how did you meet him? Do you work together? Where where, where would you meet him? Grocery store? What happened? Uh, we met on Tinder. Oh, Tinder. <laughs> and then what? Your first date? You guys talk on the app for a little while, and then you agree to go out. So what was the date? Yeah, um, it was super amazing. I, this he, he wanted to play mini golf, and I know this is going to sound crazy. I've never played mini golf. What? Which I can't believe. I know. And after playing, I can't believe it because I'm super competitive and <laughs> I'm a little playful. And we had a great time together. Like, I love mini golf. That's okay. going to be like my <laughs> new go to. <laughs> Alice is going to be the new Tiger Woods of Midway Golf and Games. Be yes. out there. Is there a mini golf driving range I can practice on? <laughs> so, so during the date itself, you said it was fun and playful, like anything awkward or ha- what? Is- no. It, and that's the thing. It was a really good date. Like He was super nice and kind. And I think I'm really good at admitting when I do something wrong. But I swear, like, I didn't say anything messed up. It Like, it felt like we had a connection and it was a good date. That's why I'm confused. This is going to sound so dumb, but you said it was his idea for mini golf, correct? And you'd never yes. played before. Did you beat him? Is that is that why, you think? Maybe? I can't I imagine. Did, I didn't beat him. I was having too much fun to even, like, I... I think I was horrible. That's why I want to go back and play again because I'm really competitive. So I tried to make it fun. Like, oh, yeah. <laughs> I'll tell you what. Worst case scenario, even if he says no or doesn't pick up or whatever, I'll still give you a gift card to Midway Golf and Games so you can go play whenever you want. Is that fair? Is that cool? <laughs> Amazing. Absolutely. Cool. I'm excited now. Right. <laughs> Hook up or hang up. This is Cosmo. It's the Y107 Morning Show, Hook Up or Hang Up time. And uh, we've just talked to Allison, who met Will here a few weeks ago on Tinder. They went and played mini golf, and she thought she had a great date. But she has admitted that she's gone a little bit overboard, 
on the messages. And he, at one point in the message, Al- Allison, are you still here? Are you 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 are there, right? <laughs> I am here. Okay. Yes. Real quick, I want to clarify because before, if he does answer, I want to make sure I, I know exactly what I'm going to say here. You did say that he told you at one point. It was it in the text message or verbally that he didn't really want you to contact him again. It was the text message. The text. Okay, I just wanted to make sure I had that story, that square because uh, yeah. this this if he told you that, then this could go very wrong. So we'll just we'll just see what happens. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Call it Will. I feel like I'm going to be a winner no matter what. I get to go mini golf. Okay, it's ringing. It's ringing. Be quiet. Be quiet. Here we go. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. Hi. Is this Will? Is Will, is Will there? Yeah, this is Will. Hi. Good morning. Uh, this is Cosmo. I'm on Y107, um, and I want to have you be on my show, but I need to ask you if it's okay if you come on, on the air with me real quick. Uh, I guess so. For okay. what reason? We, we have a, a dating and relationship segment um, called Tinder Tales. Tales from the Tinder. And um, I'm just curious about a Tinder date that you went on recently um, with a girl named Allison. Uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, um, so how did it go? Um, well, I mean... We, we played mini golf, so, you know, it, it was an all right date. I mean, who has, you know, a terrible time playing mini golf? Right. Right. So, I guess my question here on Tinder Tales, would you go out with her again? If that opportunity... Not a... Yeah, yeah, no, not a chance. No. She's a little too much. She's a little too much for me. Okay. Is it is it because she screwed up and sent a bazillion messages? Um, yeah, I mean, it was a lot of messages, but no, that wasn't the thing that bothered me first. Okay. So do, you, was, do you mind sharing what, what, what bothered you uh, first? Okay. So it's our first date, right? And she's just really touchy the whole time. I mean, she just kept slapping my butt. I mean, it was just kind of disturbing to be honest with you. She just, you know, she just met me and she's like, hey, slapping my butt. Okay. And, and and so, did you say something to her, like, when she did it a couple times? Like, hey, you know, there's, like, a whole bunch of people here. Yeah, I, I mean, I just met her, so I'm, I, I tried to tell her nicely, but, you know, it just popped to her to slap my butt again. <laughs> okay, so then let's do this, Will. This 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 is not actually called Tinder Tales. It's a segment we have we call Hook Up or Hang Up. And um, Allison wants to hook up with you again and go on another date with you. And she is here to apologize for all those messages. Right, Allison? Uh, yeah, but I also want to know how you want me to keep my hands off that butt. It's such a nice butt. Okay, this is just weird. Okay, we don't even know each other. Okay, please, just stop. I can hear you blushing it's through the phone, Will. It's not a big deal. Like, you can touch my butt if you want. <laughs> Oh, my God. You know, I mean, I respect you too much as a person to be slapping your ass so many times <laughs> on the first date. Oh, my goodness. Okay, Will, it was for the fun of it. You're being boring. <laughs> Will, Will I'm, I'm, sensing that, yeah. I'm sensing that you want to be anywhere but right here right now. Is that is that accurate? Or oh, yeah, that's really accurate. <laughs> there's no fixing anything with you two. No way. I mean, I think I'm good. I mean, I just couldn't get over the many times. I mean, she kept slapping my butt over, and over, <laughs> and over, and then the messages and yeah, I'm fine. No fixing this. Uh, I mean, if it means that much to you, I won't slap your butt again. I promise. I mean, come on. Uh, yeah, I think I'm good. I gotta go. I'm out of here. Well, <laughs> a- Allison? <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm still I, here. You know, <laughs> I guess, it, I mean, if he told you to stop, you probably should have stopped, but I, I you know, hey. So, I honestly thought he was being playful. Like, right. I didn't think it really bothered him. <laughs> right. 
Well, anyways, I, I, my offer still stands. I'll still give you the card to go play mini golf. You could bring somebody Heck else yeah. this time. Someone who doesn't mind having their butt slapped, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Did your date never call back? Have us call them. Hook up or hang up with Cosmo in the Y107 Morning Show.